hi guys welcome back to my channel please if you're new to this channel don't forget to subscribe just click that red button that says subscribe there you click that bell so they'll be forced to be notified whenever a new video is coming up in today's video i'm going to be teaching you guys how to make yummy meat pie if i the best meat pie you can ever have so let's get started so in this video i'm going to be using miss meat I got butter, I got flour, I'm using plain flour in this video, I got some chopped potato, chopped carrot, seasoning, salt, I got egg, I got vegetable oil, chopped onion, I am using corn flour, and I'm using baking powder. So let's get started. So the first thing we are going to do is to Add our baking powder and the salt together to our flour. And here is our butter. I'm just going to add it to it. So now it's time for us to mix it. So we are going to mix this until it becomes very crumbly. So you can see our dough, you can see how it is, you must mix it and crumb and crumbly. So now the next thing we are going to do here is to add our water. This is the delicate part in making dough. So now you just pour, don't pour water, all you do is just to sprinkle and mix. You must be very careful in this very, you know, moment. So guys, the tricky part about making a dough, don't over knead it, don't over miss it. See, the way you miss it, just, you know, open your hands like this and kind of like this, you know. So you can see that our dough is ready now. So now I'm just going to cover it up and let's proceed to make the meat pie fillings. So let's move to the next stage. So guys, here is time for us to start making the meat pie filling. So here is the vegetable oil. I'm just going to add it to the, to the pan. So next is to add our uh, chopped onion. You just keep stirring. You don't need too much um, vegetable oil to make uh, meat pie filling because the beef already contains some fat, you know. So with the vegetable oil, it will help us to um, stir-fry the, the onion. So we are just going to stir-fry the onion for like 1 to 2 minutes before adding the mince meat. So now we are going to add our mince meat. So we just have to keep stirring this. Just stir until the corns pale, you know. You just have to keep stirring. So now we are going to add our seasoning. Look at it. Our seasoning and our sauce. So 
we are just going to stir fry. So now it's time for us to add our vegetables. There's our vegetables. You can add more if you like. You can add less if you like. So I choose to have um, add this. So you don't like too much vegetables in the meat pie. You like more. So the vegetable depends on you how more you want it in your meat pie thing. So now we yeah. have this everything. So now it is time for us to add water. I need to turn out this out. So now we have to cover this up and allow it to cook. So see you guys soon. So guys, it's time to check our fillings to see whether it's done. So now we going to open it. So I think it's done. So the next we are going to do, here is our corn flour. The corn flour have as a thickener. You can as well use potato flour or potato starch. In my other video, I've made potato starch, I've made potato flour. So it's optional. So that I use corn flour or potato flour. It helps to thicken sauce. So now we are going to add it to our meat pie fillings. So you can see as soon as I add it, it will be ticking. Like that. So now we are going to stir. See that? It's already ticking already. We need to stir it quickly. You can see that the sauce that is watery before is not ticking. So easy to make our meat pie fillings is ready now. So now we are just going to um, now I'm going to switch up the stove and allow our mist our meat pie fillings to cool down. So here it is. So that's it. I'm going to leave it to cool down because it's still very, very hot. Good. So, see you guys in a bit. Now, egg, I'm doing other stuff. So, there is our egg. Like I told you, I'm using one egg for the, you know, to apply on the surface of the pie. So, I'm just going to stir this. going to set it aside so here is our pan we are going to prepare our pan and while we are doing this we have already preheat our oven you must preheat your oven before you add your meat pie I don't have a parchment paper so I'm just going to apply butter this is butter I'm applying on the pan avoid the meat pie sticking so when it's when it's baked if you don't want to apply if you don't want to use butter you can use parchment paper or non-sticky paper so now we are done now let's go and check our meat pie fillings so so guys says our miss meat and it's finished cooling down please it's very important you allow your miss meat to cool down so ours is cool down. So now here is our, our dough. Yeah, it has been sitting for about you know 10 to 15 minutes. If you don't want it to sit like that, you can also add it to fridge. Add it to the fridge. So now let's proceed to the molding. So guys, here is our baking mat. And here is our meat pie mold. Here's our rolling pin. So here I got flour to just sprinkle on the baking mat so that it doesn't stick. So now let's 
the start. So first of all, I'm just going to cut out some little bit of dough and add it to the baking mat. So we're just going to roll. Please don't overwork your dough. Don't overwork your dough. If you want to have a better result, don't overwork your dough. And rolling it out depends on how. Don't make it too thin. Don't make it too thick. So now we are going to add this. So now we are just going to. Here is a mince meat. So I'm going to just add the mince meat to it. Hope you guys are seeing what I'm doing. Look at that. Please don't overfill your your meat pie so that it doesn't burst out when it's baking. So now I'm just going to add this to the pie. So look at that. Yes, meat pie. Yeah. So don't want then we are going to do the rest like that. Add the miss meat, the fillings. Like I said, don't over add them and cover. So this time I'm going to do the whole of it. So look at that. See how beautiful our meat pie is looking. So this time I'm going to do the whole of it. So guys, here is our meat pie. You can see how beautiful it's looking. So the first, next we're going to do is to pierce it. This will enable it to get done inside. Just pierce it with a fork. Very important. So I'm going to do all of them like that. So we are done with the piercing of the fork. So the next is to start applying egg on the surface of the meat pie. This will enable your meat pie to be very, to be very, very shiny. Make it look so inviting, you know. Make it look shiny. So this I'm going to do the whole of it. So like I said, while we are doing this, uh, uh, oven is still getting is preheating you must preheat your oven so here is our meat pie so now i'm going to transfer it to the oven and i allow it to bake for about 40 45 minutes so see you guys soon wow Wow, guys, here is our meat pie, it's finished baking. So now I'm going to open one of them and show you guys how it is on the inside. Look at that. Wow. Wow, guys, look at that. Mm, and now I'm going to be having a taste for it. Mm. This tastes so yummy. Look at that. Look at the feeling, so rich. I want to thank you guys for watching my video. Please, if you like my video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. And don't forget to share. Bye.